Hey guys, it's Katie and we are officially in packing mode. If you don't know, I'm moving to Florida in four days and I have zero packed, literally nothing. And my room currently looks like this with the bed on the floor. Basically no progress has been made besides my bed frame being taken apart and I bought moving boxes. We have a lot to do in the next four days. Thankfully I have backup. My mom and my grandma are here to help and we are about to take this room from completely full to completely empty because this will no longer be my room. This will soon be the decor guest bedroom. You're gonna fill boxes, we're gonna fold and you're gonna put them in there? I guess. All right, cool. Say hi to the vlog. Hi vlog. Hi. <laughs> this is my packing team. I'm already done. I'm almost halfway folding all my sweatshirts. Woo -hoo. If I would do this, it would take three days alone. <laughs> but I built the box, so I guess that's my contribution. Oh, yes. <laughs> of all the things. I built the box. Build a box, build a bear. <laughs> this is how I do mine when I pack every summer to winter, winter to summer. I just do like yeah. that. Okay. And then I put the other way, the other way. Closet number two is now being packed. My old work shirt. Definitely don't need that. Grandma's doing those, so what are you doing now? What are you doing? Uh, the top of the closet. Top? Yes. Okay. I'm definitely gonna need more boxes. Oh no. Right. Oh, you got lots of grocery bags. Yep. In Hawaii, they don't let you remember? Yes. You have to use reusable ones. Oh, lots of hats. We're probably just gonna wrap those separately. <laughs> now. Look at that. That's some good packing. This was my map from my grad party. Everyone signed it, and I want to hang it up in my apartment. It's, little, it's cute. Little, now we're talking. <laughs> now I can actually lay it on its side. This right. looks funny. Do you have anything else that should go into the garage? There's another box out there. Okay. You want to help me pick it up? Yeah, but I'm gonna, we're gonna close this first. So my outside closet is now emptied. This is all the stuff that's staying that like isn't mine. The only thing that's staying that's mine is my prom dress because I don't really need to take that. And we have these empty drawers that are also staying. They're just good storage. So that one's officially empty and packed. And then outside in the garage, this is where all my other stuff has been living. Like I said, I ordered so much stuff that I need from Amazon. So like my air fryer, a broom, a lamp, all of my water bottles, like all my stuff that is coming with is being packed. I also have like different stuff that I wanna hang on the walls, prints and things. And then here's more. So obviously my suitcases are coming. This is a bookshelf that I ordered. All of my books are packed. So this is a lot of stuff that has been building as well. <laughs> Look at this progress. Only toilet paper under my sink. The calories are cleared off besides like my immediate toiletries and my shower stuff. All my shower stuff is gone. Oh, mess, 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 mess. But the closet's empty. Yay. It's so freaking loud in here because Brian is vacuuming. But the first day of packing has now commenced. We made lots and lots of progress as you guys I saw and my room feels so incredibly empty. It doesn't look so empty, but that's because things have been taken out of drawers and closets and bins and that kind of stuff, but it is very empty. As you guys saw, I still have three leftover boxes, which is perfect because obviously I'm not done fully packing. And then my pillows will get packed. That's stuff that I'm listing on my Depop. So you guys should definitely check that out. Um, I'm selling so much clothes and shoes and all that on there. It's just Katie McKenzie because I'm moving out, obviously. Then we have my little Alani news that are definitely getting packed. I showed you guys earlier, like my whole bag bathroom is empty. I just have a few little products left that I'm going to be using, but literally all my toiletries are packed. But look, like empty, empty, empty besides cleaning stuff. So we made good progress. We really did. And I'm happy with it. We're taking a U-Haul. So like all my furniture will be coming. So that's why my bed frame is already unpacked. But like nightstand will be coming. Desk will be coming. This will be coming. I think this has to be the craziest part of it because it's all freaking packed. Like I have so many boxes of my stuff that's going with and now it's it's all organized in the garage. I am taking my shoe racks with me. Those will be packed as well, my little suitcases. But yeah, this is like a majority of the stuff that's gonna be packed in the U-Haul besides furniture. And it's all in one place now. So it actually looks like Katie's actually moving out. <laughs> but yeah, that's all for day one, I guess. Yay, lots of progress today. So yes, it is the next day. And yes, I'm wearing the same shirt. I really don't wanna hear it. <laughs> I didn't leave my house yesterday or today. So it is what it is. But guys, I just got new stickers for my Yeti and look how cute she is. I love decorating her. A lot of them are from Hawaii. Look, this one's gotta be one of my favorites. Hawaii makes me happy. There's like really cute ones like right here. Explore
explore outdoors together we can save the world i love her we got so much done yesterday really all i've been doing today is clearing off my desk and i'm gonna put the stuff in here like these pillows for instance my pillows are getting packed and i don't really need this box for anything oh guys look at this pillow from youtube they sent me a shorts pillow this box is just kind of for random crap because this was the box my trash can got delivered in so i collect shells to every beach that i go to and i have bags and bags of shells and shark teeth and rocks these rocks are from my trip to italy with bella from last year i've been collecting them for so long because i knew i always wanted to display them in my own place i've been in a reading slump recently so i ordered new books and got new books from hawaii when i was there at my favorite bookstore and i'm definitely not gonna be able to read all of these in the next <laughs> three days so i'm gonna have to pack the rest of these in this box but i think i'm gonna leave this one out because i really want to read this after series it's been recommended to me so much once i'm done reading my current book i'm gonna read this and i'm bringing this on our drive with me this is a fat book i'm so excited the rest of these are gonna be packed you know what this is just the random box of stuff that's the only box i'm gonna be packing today because the rest of it will be packed in a u-haul on i think it's thursday or friday i don't remember but yeah the room is just getting emptier and emptier time to tape her up Now we label. This is random, so I just write random bedroom. I have terrible handwriting. I've never had good handwriting. And then I'm gonna put pillows, books. What else did I put in here? Bags, candle. Okay, just so I can like make a mental note and I remember what's in all the boxes. But yeah, I guess it's really for day two. The big day will be when we move everything into the U-Haul. It's U-Haul day. Tomorrow is the day that I'm driving with my parents to Florida and then I move in on Saturday. Today is Thursday and we are packing the U-Haul because we are leaving early tomorrow. So that means everything's getting packed. This room will be empty tonight, like actually empty. So I unfortunately, Unfortunately, will not be able to sleep in my bed for my last night in my room because that needs to get packed in the U-Haul. The dresser, packed in the U-Haul. The desk, packed in the U-Haul. Everything's getting packed in the U-Haul, but I am packing my little suitcase right now because we are spending one night at my grandma's house, my Mimi's house, before I move in on Saturday. But yeah, literally everything that you see here is gonna go now. And the U-Haul's parked right out there. You can't see it, but time to move to Florida. Here she is. This is my U-Haul. About to be freaking full. Oh, we got one box. <laughs> we got one box. I've never been inside a U-Haul before. This is gonna be full real soon. My U-Haul, my U-Haul. She moving out. U-Haul progress has been made and yet we still have a lot more to give. Ooh, why is it bumpy? Ooh. Fish tank. Uh, this is my dresser. It's kind of gross. I want to get a new one, but it's gonna have to deal for now so We wrapped the shoes up in the saran wrap and got a bunch of boxes already so. See, That's what happens when you drop it on its corner. Oh, I broke it. Uh-oh We have been lifting all the big heavy stuff We just moved my bed into the u-haul and that was extremely difficult I tried to record it, but my camera ran out of storage on the SD card So you didn't see that but my father's depriving me of food So now I'm gonna eat some chicken nuggets with some barbecue sauce because I'm starving. I mean, it's 128. It's getting hot out there now. It was like 40 degrees, but now it's hot and sweaty. So I'm gonna put some shorts on. But we have a few more heavy things to lift and then just like little boxes. But my room is pretty empty now. So this is weird, very weird. 
I love how the drawers of the inside of my dresser are just like sitting out. We haven't put those back in the dresser yet. Hi, Kippy. Hi, Mel. I'm gonna miss you. I'm a. Oh, why are you running away from me? I'm gonna miss you. Big booty girl. Big booty. The U-Haul is packed. I'm talking to this lady on Facebook Marketplace to get a couch, and if we get the couch, then we're gonna put her right here. But that's all my stuff. For now. Success. <laughs> well, y'all, that's it. My bedroom is officially empty. Right here, this little suitcase is what I'm packing to take to my grandma's house, and I have my backpack and an extra box just in case, but everything fit into the U-Haul, and I'm going to pick up a couch with my dad a little bit later tonight, but yeah, that's me officially moving out of my parents' house. This is so crazy, but I'm really excited about what the near future holds, and you guys will get to watch all of it, obviously, through all my social media, so thank you so much for your love and support always. I would not be able to do any of this as if it wasn't for y'all. Like, you are the reason I'm able to move out of my parents' house and pay for it on myself your love is just never forgotten ever i promise <laughs> so subscribe if you're new lots of fun moving and adulting content coming and that's it for the last georgia vlog you'll see in a while bye guys